I'm Brad Nessler, joined by the coach, Lee Corso, and the quarterback, Kirk Herbstreet. The stars are out, but it'll probably still feel like midday because the heat is unrelenting for this game between the Colorado Buffaloes and the Houston Cougars. Well, folks, we're excited to bring you what appears to be another great gridiron matchup. Colorado is so explosive because they try to get the ball into this receiver's hands as much as possible. And what he can do after the catch is what makes him one of the best in the game. And they'll win this game big. Nice pick, Kirk. Buffalo all the way. They'll set up shot at the 25-yard line. First and 10. The Cougs come out in a shotgun. Griffin on first down. Looks. Going deep on the left side. Batted ball. Oh, he had the pick and he dropped it. Good job there by the defense to get a hand on it. It was, Kirk, but when you're going out for a pass and a ball is in the air, you need to go after it and come down with it. You just can't watch the defender bat it down. The Cougars line up with four wideouts. Throws to the middle. Finds his receiver. They'll grab 10 yards there. Third down, less than a yard. Ball on their own 35. Ham with a takedown. And the tailback picks up the first down. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 36. On the 36 yard line. Little shake and bake move. They'll get six yards. Gain of six on the play. Second and four coming up here. Ball on their own 42. Griffin with three wide receivers. Griffin set to go to the air. Steps up in the pocket. Chucks it deep down the right side. The ball is tipped. It falls incomplete. He couldn't make the catch inbound. He can't fault the receiver. He did all he could to make the catch. The pass was just too far out of play. The defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. The Cougs come out in a shotgun. Griffin with the give. Jukwu. And the run is good for the first. Yep, this is nothing new. If you follow this team, they like to run the ball in these kind of situations. Terrific third down play call there. First and ten, and this is the seventh play of the current drive. They'll bring in their dime package. Back to pass. Throws this one out to the right. Got it. To the 20, to the 10. Touchdown, Houston! The wideout makes a big catch there. Hey, whenever you have a receiver who can make plays like that, you just want to get the ball in his hands and let him do the work. Listen up, my friend. That was a tremendous throw by the quarterback, too. Don't forget about the guy slinging the ball all over the field out there. And he hits the PAT. And here's the Pontiac drive summary. Kicks it deep. Hunter fields it in the end zone. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll get the ball here at the 25. 
They line up in the shotgun. They'll throw on first down. It's deflected. He's gobbled up in the backfield. That's a loss of about three. Second and 13. Ball on the 22. Ball on the 22 yard line. Colorado lines up in a shotgun set. Sanders back to throw. He tosses it short. Almost intercepted. That could have easily been a turnover. Yeah, I don't even think the quarterback even saw that guy. Well, he almost saw him running the other direction with the football. Third and 13 coming up. Ball on their own 22. Colorado comes out in the shotgun. Drops back to pass. Looking. Long ball right side. Couldn't haul it in. Dropped by the wideout. Number three, the intended receiver on the play. Colorado ready to put this one away. It's away, and it's a booming punt. Campbell fields it to 29. They moved the ball very effectively on their last drive, which ended with a touchdown. The defense has been talking it over on the sideline, trying to make some corrections. Let's see if they can stop them this time. They'll go to work at the 33-yard line. Three wideouts here. They'll throw on first down. Wants to throw outside. Bounce to would be tackler. Knocked out of bounds. Way to look it in. Nice catch. Sure was. He displayed some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. It's first and ten. Ball on the 46. They'll bring in their dime package. Griffin off the fake. He's looking. He's going to go for the home run. And he's got it! They'll bring him down. Now that was a good looking play. The quarterback put it where his receiver could get it, and now they have a first down. What I like is the faith that this quarterback has in his receiver. He's not afraid to throw it downfield. Right. Houston comes out with three receivers right. bunched. Right. Griffin steps back to pass. To the end zone! What a close call for this defense. You're absolutely right. You're not going to see him drop the ball like that too often. What a break for the defense. Well, Lee, it's their first trip to the red zone today, and they haven't really done very well so far this season. Yeah, but my friend, today is a new day. Let's see if they can get it across the goal line and light up the scoreboard. A little juke. They'll drop him for a loss. Williams makes the stop. No gain on the play. Look at how dominant they've been on defense. Well, I'll tell you, as an offense, you've been pretty successful if you can even sniff the end zone against these guys. Whoa, they're one of the best in the country. Just look at those numbers. He jukes. Touchdown, Houston. The quarterback just burrowed his way into the end zone on that one. That's probably the simplest play you could run. Snap it and start pushing that defensive line backwards. The next thing you know, put the points on the scoreboard. And he tacks on the extra point. So down to just a few seconds left in the first quarter with a score. Houston, 14. Colorado, nothing. Hunter back deep to return. Here's the kick. And we've got a penalty on this one as it goes out of bounds. You gotta keep the kick in bounds. Here's the ref's call. 
Illegal procedure on the kicking team. The ball is spotted at the 35 yard His errant kick has given down. the offense a great starting point to begin their drive. Absolutely. The defense will have to come out with major intensity to make up for that one. They'll start this drive at the 35 yard line. From the gun. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Morris brings him down. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. And that'll be the end of the first quarter with our score. Houston, 14. Colorado, nothing. It's second down and nine to go. Ball on the 36. The Buffs set up in the gun. Looks. He tosses it short. And it's caught. And they make the stop. That play fake good for five yards. Five yard gain on the play. As you can see, they have really had some difficulty getting the ball down the field. You got that right, Brad. These guys have better step it up and execute when they have the ball, or else it's going to be a long day. High snap as he works from the gun. Complete. That's how you convert on third down. This defense had to be expecting pass. I know that. It doesn't matter, though. It's not enough to know that they were passing. You got to know their tendencies, too. First and ten. Ball on the 48-yard line. Snap it to the back. And he's tackled. They go with a run, and that'll be a gain of nine. Nine-yard gain on the play. Second and one coming up here. Ball on the 43-yard line. Colorado lines up in a shotgun set. Looking, throws it to the outside. Oh, he had a shot at the pick. He just couldn't find the handle. That poor kid looked like he was trying to catch a greased pig. Easy, Scooter. At least he kept the receiver from making the play. The defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. They line up in the shotgun. Sanders drops to throw. He's looking. Throws this one out to the left. And it's caught. Brought down. Number one. Gain of 10 on the play. First and 10. Ball on the 33-yard line. Sanders is the impact player, and he's feeling it right now. He's hit and got away. Tackle. Sanders with the carry. One yard gain on the play. Second and nine coming up here. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Sanders is in the zone and looking to make a play. He drops back. Steps up with the spin. Breaks one. He takes off. Here's an opening. And he's tackled five, maybe six yards there on the scramble. It's third down and three to go. This is the ninth play of this drive. On the ground with the tailback. Brooks with a takedown. And he's going to come up short of the first down. Back to pass. He tosses it short. And it's a true freshman. They're living on the edge right now. Fourth and short. I can't believe they put the ball in the air. I can't believe they actually got the first. This coach isn't afraid to take some risks. Ball on the 
First and ten. Ball on the 21-yard line. The Buffs come out in a shotgun. They'll throw on first down. Looks like he's going to run. And down he goes. Colorado calls a timeout. This offense has done an unbelievable job getting points once they enter the red zone. That's right. These guys get it done better than almost anybody in the country. The Buffs come out showing three wide. Drop back to pass. And they try to set up a screen. Finds the true freshman. Colorado takes a timeout. About 12 yards out. Now's not the time for a blown coverage. This quarterback is in the zone. They'll run for the first on third and short. Sheds that one. Touchdown, Colorado! This one might be coming back, folks. Let's check out the penalty. Personal foul. Face mask on the defense. Well, the offense is helped out by that defensive penalty. You bet they are. That's an easy way to pick up yards. He hits the PAT. Time to take a look at the drive summary. It's brought to you by Pontiac. Fuel for the soul. up for the kickoff. Number 18, back to return. Kicks it off. They moved the ball very effectively on their last drive, which ended with a touchdown. The defense has been talking it over on the sideline, trying to make some corrections. Let's see They'll if they can stop them this time. It's first and, first and 10. Ball on the 25. Yeah. Three wide outs here. Snap goes to the back. Big opening. They'll bring him down. Houston calls a timeout. It's second down and four to go. Ball on the 31-yard line. They'll bring in their dime package. He drops back. Comes across the middle. Brought down. So it's complete, but they didn't get much there. And that's because the defense was just waiting on it, and they attacked. The quarterback should have found somebody else downfield. The Cougars are going to take a timeout, and they'll have one timeout left. Third down and a yard. Ball in the 34. Houston. Comes out in the shotgun. Hot, hot. Hot, hot. Griffin drops back. He steps up, throws this one out to the left. And he brings it down. Hunter brings him down. Hot. Spikes the ball. Second and ten. Ball right around midfield. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Throws it to the outside. Complete. They just took what the defense gave them on that play. Yeah, you're right. That was a good job of getting that pass completed for positive yardage. Third down and three coming up. And this is the sixth play of the drive. They'll bring in their dime package. 
cut. Griffin, back to pass. He's been perfect on this drive. Looks, rolling out to the right side. He passes it. It's tipped. And the corner got in there and broke that one up. The Cougs have five receivers on this play. They'll throw for it. Steps up. He wants it all going long. Touchdown, Houston! And he tacks on the extra point. Folks, let's pause now as we've reached the end of the first half. Our score at halftime, Houston 21, Colorado 7. Second half just about set to get underway as the teams line up for the kick. Sanders back deep to return. And he got all of this one. Great kick. Sanders fields it in the end zone. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll set up shot at the 25-yard line. Throw on first down. He tosses it short. Complete to the true freshman. A pickup of about three. Second and seven. Ball on the 28. Colorado lines up in a shotgun set. Drop back to pass. He'll dump this one off. And it's caught. And he's taken down. Four yards on that play. Gain of four on the play. It's third down and three to go. Ball on their own 32. He jukes him. Excellent open field tackle. Sanders on the run. Seven yard gain on the play. First and ten. Ball on the 39. yard I wouldn't try anything tricky on defense. This quarterback's looking to make a play. He steps up across the middle. It's tipped. Great range as he's able to break up the pass. I know that the safety makes a good play here, but as a receiver, you got to get in there and play some defense. He's lucky that one wasn't intercepted. So it's second and ten, and this is the fifth play of the current drive. From the gun, he drops back. Short toss, complete, and they make the stop. So the defense kept everything in front of them on that play. They didn't pick up much on that play, but if they keep dumping it off like that, the safeties are going to have to creep up. When you force the safeties to play shallow, it opens up a whole other passing game. That's when you hit them with the home run. Colorado comes out of the shotgun, steps up in the pocket, looking, gets past the tackler. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Logan gets it off. 
Campbell fields it to the 26, and he is drilled. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. They'll get the ball here at the 27-yard line. Three wideouts to the right side. Cat, 82. Hunt. They'll throw on first down. Wants to throw outside. Hunter with a takedown. Wow, nice catch. Way to look it in. Heck of a job by the wide receiver. These guys are moving the ball down the field. Right, it's first and 10. Ball on the 43. The Cougar come out in a bunch formation. He's looking. Throws this one out to the right. High pass, and it's caught! Touchdown, Houston! He's got three touchdown passes in this game. And that last one was the best of the bunch, if you'd ask me. Great throw, great catch. And he hits the PAT. Here's the drive summary brought to you by Pontiac. Houston is ready to kick it away. Sanders and Hunter back ready to return. Kicks it deep. Sanders fields it in the end zone. They're just about ready to get this drive started. After their last series had some promise, but it ended with a punt. They'll go to work at the 25-yard line. Colorado lines up for the shotgun set. Back to pass. Steps up. Looks. They'll make the sack. I don't think the quarterback ever saw him. Heck, I didn't even see him. He was in there before anybody could say, look out. It's second down and a long ways to go. Ball on the 19-yard line. Nickel defense. Sanders, back to pass, throws in a hurry. The true freshman has it. Loss of about two. Third down and what they didn't want to get in. Ball on the 17-yard line. Sanders, set to go to the air. He decides to run with it. And down he goes. The Buffs line up to punt. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. Campbell takes it at the 21. Now we see the offense come out of the field. And you know who's trembling right now? That defensive secondary. The secondary should be trembling after all the yards that they gave up that last time. They'll, They'll start this drive at the 28. First and 10. The defense lines up with six DBs. Griffin steps back to pass. He'll dump this one off. And it's caught. And he's taken down. Short pass there, and they get a moderate gain. There's nothing wrong with nickel and diamond him down the field. It's second down and three to go. Ball on their own 35. The Cougars with four receivers. Griffin drops the throw. Throw. Complete. There he goes. Tries to juke. Oliver brings him down. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result is a first down. First and 10, ball on the 47. Yeah. They'll 
they'll work from the shotgun. Hot, hot. Hot. Hot, hot. A move. And he's tackled. Four yard gain by the back. Gain of four on the play. It's second down and six to go. Ball on the 49. They're lining up in the 5 2. And they're going to play keep away and work this clock. Third and four. Ball on the 47-yard line. From the gun. Takes a timeout. The Cougars line up the punt. It's away and it's a booming punt. And this one's going to go out of bounds at the 17 yard line. This defense did a good job on the last series. They forced the offense to go three plays and out. And now they're looking to drill off of that and shut them down again right here. They'll set up shot at the 20-yard line. Sanders comes to the line with three wide. Sanders back to throw, looking. Wants to throw outside. And that one's fallen incomplete. Major, the intended receiver on the play. Second and 10. Ball on the 20 yard line. They'll work from the shotgun. Drops back to pass. Throws in a hurry. He got it! Oh, what a hit! Colorado calls a timeout. It's first and ten. Ball on the 44. The Buffalo set up in the gun. Short draw. Incomplete. Whoa! That was a bullet. A bullet that landed incomplete. I don't care. That was some impressive arm strength. Second and 10, ball on the 44-yard line. They come out in a nickel. Nickel defense. He drops back. He's got an opening. He spins, and down he goes. That scramble gets them seven yards. Seven-yard gain on the play. They come out in a nickel. Back to pass. With the throw, and it's caught. Coffee with a takedown. A nice completion that time. Good completion, and I don't know if you guys noticed or not, but that was exactly the same play they just ran. They're not very creative in their play calling. Creative? You don't need to be creative with these kind of results. Second, 
So it's second and ten. And this is the seventh play of the current drive. They line up in the shotgun. Drops back to pass. He steps up. He's looking. He throws it. Someone got a hand on it. The defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. The Buffalo come out in the shotgun. Sanders drops back, steps up in the pocket, has some daylight, and they make the stop. Sanders. Have a look at our Old Spice Red Zone numbers. Red Zone, when performance matters the most. The Buffs come out in a two-tight end set, and it's picked off. Looks like the quarterback was rattled by that pressure. Well, let me tell you, the best ones will sit there and take a hit and make the throw. This kid's got to stand there if he wants those passes completed to his team, not the other. They'll take over at the five-yard line. At the five-yard line, first and ten. Campbell is dangerous. Let's see if they put the ball in his hands. There he goes. The running game hasn't been much of a factor out there. They've been too busy throwing it all over the field. If they're not stopping the pass, you don't have to worry about running the ball. And that's the end of the ball game. Kirk, what'd you think of this one? You know, I think it was a well-played game for the most part. Colorado had a few missed opportunities in this game. I think if they could have capitalized on a few of them, it would have been a lot closer, and they might even have won this game. The fine that's folks the at EA Sports, game. thank you for oh, tuning in to this contest of NCAA Football 2006. The final score, Houston 28, Colorado 7. This is Brad Nessler for Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit saying so long.